North Korea vows thousands fold revenge on US over sanctions. North Korea has vowed to bolster its nuclear arsenal and launch thousands fold revenge against the US in response to tough UN sanctions imposed after its intercontinental ballistic missile launches. Its warning came two days after the UN Security Council unanimously approved new sanctions to punish North Korea, including a ban on coal and other exports worth more than $1 billion, 766 million pounds. Nikki Haley, America's ambassador to the UN, called the US drafted resolution the single largest economic sanctions package ever leveled against North Korea. In a statement carried by state media, the North Korean government said the sanctions were a violent infringement of its sovereignty and were caused by a heinous US plot to isolate and stifle the country. It said the UN sanctions would never force it to negotiate over its nuclear program or to give up its efforts to strengthen its nuclear capability. North Korea said it would take action of justice but did not elaborate. North Korea Missile Interactive North Korea test launched two ICBMs last month as part of its efforts to develop a long-range missile capable of striking anywhere on the US mainland. Both missiles were fired at high angles and analysts say the weapons would be capable of reaching parts of the US if fired at a normal, flattened trajectory. The centerpiece of the UN sanctions is a ban on North Korean exports of coal, iron, lead and seafood products and a ban on all countries importing these products, estimated to be worth more than $1 billion in hard currency. According to a UN Security Council diplomat, coal has been North Korea's largest export, earning $1.2 billion last year which was then restricted by the Security Council in November to a maximum $400 million. This year, Pyongyang was estimated to earn $251 million from iron and iron ore exports, $113 million from lead and lead ore exports, and $295 million from fish and seafood exports, the diplomat said.